Now, your 21 Alive first alert forecast. Yesterday, we tied a record and we got some long awaited rain showers. And some of that rain from late last night is lingering into early this morning. We'll start to dry out more as we go into the afternoon, but by this evening, isolated rain chances pick up yet again. It won't be quite as widespread compared to what we've seen overnight, but nonetheless, this is some rain that has been sorely lacking in the forecast for more than a week. So this is really nice to see a lot of the rain showers from late last night continuing to dwindle down this morning, only dealing with a few hit or miss light showers early this morning, and that's mostly moving off into northwest Ohio at this point. But notice we do have a, still a few more lingering showers over in north central Indiana that could try to push in for parts of Kosciuszko, Wabash, perhaps even Noble and LaGrange counties before that likely dries up as it moves more to the east as well. Future track is a little ahead of schedule showing when things are fully dry. I take it to that it's probably starting to push ahead by about two hours early this morning, but otherwise the rest of the day still looking to be partly cloudy and we again should be mostly dry for your afternoon hours. Later this evening, though, we'll likely see the chance for a few more pop up showers and thunderstorms. I think future track starts to clump these together a little bit more than what I'm expecting for this evening, but it does a really good job with the timing. So any after school activities, any evening activities, likely dodging some showers and thunderstorms yet again. But this will not last all night long like some of our showers and thunderstorms from last night did. In fact, we start to dry up past midnight and we should be dry going into the start of tomorrow. Temperatures right now in the Midwest holding on to the low 70s. That rain helped to cool us off at least a little bit. We'll maintain the 70s for the early morning hours, making it into the low 80s by about 11 to noon and highs today cresting at 90 degrees. Not quite at the record tying temperatures we had yesterday, but still feeling hot and steamy with this being the hottest day of the week. We will still stay humid over the rest of the work week and school week, but over this weekend into next week, we quickly dry out with the humidity and it feels much more comfortable. It's always nice to look forward to the weekend, especially when it's a holiday weekend. So if you're getting ready for any plans for Saturday, Sunday or Monday, it looks beautiful. Low 80s for the weekend and even slipping into the 70s by Monday. And that probably won't be the only day that we'll see the 70s for next week. It looks like a much more fall like trend yet again going into next week. So for all the hot weather lovers, Enjoy today, tomorrow, and Friday because it's not lasting. Yeah, yeah, there's something for everyone in this forecast. There is, but I think a lot of people are ready for a cooler pattern after this week's heat. Yeah, I agree. Okay, Liz, thank you so much.